If you are looking for a delicious meal in a historic setting, be sure to check out Martin's Tavern. This restaurant has been locally owned for four generations since 1933. Every U.S. president from Harry S. Truman to George W. Bush has dined at Martin's Tavern. Richard Nixon enjoyed ordering meatloaf in booth number two with colleagues from Congress. And this is the location where JFK proposed to Jackie on June 24th, 1953. Here is the Richard Nixon booth right next to the proposal booth. Martin's serves brunch every day until four o'clock. So I tried the Martin's Chesapeake Benedict. These were their famous petite crab cakes over fried green tomatoes topped with poached eggs and house-made hollandaise. This was truly an amazing meal, but I will let my plate show you guys how much I loved it. For a delicious bagel, you have to try Call Your Mother Deli. This is the Georgetown location. It is beautiful on the outside. It was crowded inside because it is so popular, but if there is a line, it is definitely worth the wait. I ordered the Sun City Bagel Sandwich. This was pastrami with egg, and it had melty American and cheddar cheeses. The ingredient that really made it pop was the spicy honey and this was served on an everything bagel. The only downfall to this location is there is no seating indoors, but Georgetown University was just a short walk away, so I took my sandwich and enjoyed it on their beautiful lawn. Next, I went to Chinatown for Rarin Ramen and Bar. This is one of the most popular restaurants in Chinatown. The noodles are made in-house fresh. First of all, I started with the house-made pork dumplings. Next, I had the Rarin Signature Ramen. This had a rich and creamy broth with soft pork belly, tea eggs, and baby bok choy. If you are in Chinatown, I highly recommend Rarin Ramen and Bar. And those were my favorite restaurants in Washington, D.C. As always, thank you so much for watching and please subscribe.